This message is for my brothers and sisters of the Brown community. Don't get confused because we've had conversations in the past that the black community is totally separate from people of color. And the Brown community is a part of the people of color category. I won't get into why there's that separation, but I want you to understand that there is a separation. Black people are totally separate from every other minority group, which would be a part of the people of color group. So with that said, members of the Brown community, my brothers and sisters, the ones who are saying that they aren't going to vote for Genocide Joe, the ones that are saying that they're going to vote third party, the ones that are saying that they aren't going to vote at all. Mm -hmm. I got a video that I want to share with you, and I want you to understand that you not voting, you voting third party, yeah, that will put these people in charge. Like I walk around my neighborhood and it's not that there are different shades of, you know, white and brown, who cares? Um, no, it's, I mean, it's like full straight up Hindu garb at the our neighborhood swimming pool that my daughter is asking, I'm trying to explain She's like, you know, what, like, and I don't even know what country I'm in, in my own neighborhood. I just, I don't, I don't know where I am. It's, you know, I mean, the, the number of, it, when we go on a family walk, the number of Pakistani, Hindu, all, all these different, not just ethnicities, but religions with, with visible religious outfits on. Um, and, you know, the same thing, like when we go to Costco, I'm like, where, where am I? You know, and so like every, I mean, it's rare. Like we'll go on a family walk and every now and then we'll pass by, you know, a white, a white family that's a man and a woman and has more than one kid. And, uh, and every time I see it, I'm like, I don't want to be this way, but I feel like this like small sense of relief. Like I see you. I'm glad, I'm glad you're one of my neighbors because at the end of the day, again, it's not about whiteness. Uh, but at the end of the day, if things get rough, I don't know if my Hindu neighbor is going to fight to save the lives of my children. That is called Christian nationalism. Mm -hmm. And while they're spewing their hatred and their discrimination and their racism, they have the unmitigated gall to mention that they don't know if it came down to a fight, if the people that they hate, that they discriminate against would stand up and fight for them or their children. This, this is how they think and this is what they think of you. And it is absolutely a matter of whiteness. When I go to Costco, and I see my Pakistani brothers and sisters and, and my brothers and sisters in their authentic garb. I say, hey, how you doing? I don't think anything else of it. That's the difference between the way I think and the way Christian nationalists think. And you not voting? You saying you're not going to vote for Genocide Joe? You saying you're going to vote for th third party? You're going to put the people who think this way in charge. Yeah. Happy Friday, everybody.